Local hospitals, meantime, are hoping the COVID-19 vaccine should provide some much needed relief. CBS 4's Alexa Green is live showing you when hospital staff here in the Hoosier State could see their first immunizations. Alexa, good morning. Good morning to you, Angela and Nick, and the hope is within a few weeks. So we're talking about mid-December. Here's the timeline. As you two mentioned, tomorrow the FDA will meet to discuss giving emergency use authorization to the Pfizer vaccine. Then if approved, the vaccine will be distributed in the coming weeks to about 50 hospitals here in Indiana. IU Methodist in Indianapolis will be one of the first hospitals in the state to get it. The next day, 50 other hospitals expect the vaccine. That includes IU Bloomington in Monroe County. Officials there say it first will be offered to healthcare workers. It then will be distributed at long-term care facilities. But people who get the vaccine are still recommended to wear masks, social distance, and wash their hands. This vaccine is a two-dose vaccine, so you aren't completely um, immune or, or those antibodies aren't built until you have had the second dose. That follow-up shot comes 21 days after the first one. It also must be of the same brand. Royce Kennedy believes the vaccine may be available mid-January for what they call wannabe recipients. That could be essential workers or older adults with comorbidities. Angela and Nick, we'll send it back to you.